Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And if you're a Windows 11 user, you have updates today. There's security updates that are available for Windows 11 21H2 and 22H2. So if you uh, go on your settings, go into Windows Update. And the reason for these updates is the Patch Tuesday updates. Today is the second Tuesday for the month of February 2023. So this is Security Update Tuesday, as Microsoft calls it. So if you look at the update history, if you have uh, maybe uh, they installed already, or if you are looking at Windows updates, you should see them. These are mandatory. Uh, the updates come in several different little updates. You might see a, um, of course, um, malicious software removal tool update. You might see a anti-malware update. But there's going to be a .NET Framework update, which has one critical security flaw. Uh, and you'll see also the uh, Windows 11 updates. The uh, KB number is different depending on 21H2 or 22H2. If you're on 21H2, your KB number here is 502-2836. If you're on 22H2, like I am, it's KB 502-2836. 45 and these are the security updates that are available today fixes a certain number of flaw we're going to talk about it in a separate video for windows 11 um, and so it's very important to apply these updates to make sure that you stay safe on your system now if you are on the uh, windows um, 21h2 or 22h2 you'll have different uh, kb you'll have different version numbers so on 20 if you go into the um, the start menu and you type in the search um, Windover for windows version in 20 in 21 h2 you guys will see in this little panel 22,000 dot 1574 22,000 dot 1574 if like me you are on 22 h2 you will see 22621.1265. That means you're up to date to the latest updates and you are now secure. Uh, very important because there's some zero days in there, including critical flaws exploded in the wild already. And we're going to talk about what's in Windows 11 updates in the next video. Exactly. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.